Well, in this video, I'm going to be discussing different actions that can be taken by sophomores in order to help them prepare for their applications that they will fill out during their senior year. Number one is earn top grades. Students, you probably hear this from your parents and teachers all the time, but your GPA is the number one factor considered by college admission counselors when they review applications for admission. So earn the best grades you can. The second factor that is the most important of all is the difficulty of your curriculum. This means that college admission counselors are reviewing the courses that you've taken and how rigorous they are. As a result, you should be taking all the AP, Advanced Placement, International Baccalaureate, if they're offered at your high school, and honors courses that you can possibly handle. You need to show that you are ready for the difficulty of the academics in college, and by taking these higher level courses, you're going to show admission counselors that you are ready. The next thing that you need to really do is to take classes that correspond to your intended college major. If, for example, you know you're going to be an engineering major, well, you should be taking uh, four years of math, ending your senior year with a year of calculus. If you can't really finish with a calculus uh, year, you should at a minimum finish with a year of pre-calculus. If you're majoring in English, you want to take the advanced placement English composition and English literature courses that are offered at your high school. You need to really be, be prepared for that major and show college admission counselors that you've done all you can to be an incoming, well-prepared student. The next thing you should do as a sophomore is build excellent relationships with adults. This would include your high school counselor, teachers, and other adults such as uh, sports coaches or clergymen in your church or perhaps supervisors at your job if you have a part-time job. You want to build these relationships because in the fall of your senior year, you're likely going to be asking these people for letters of recommendation. And if you build a strong rapport with these people, they're going to write excellent letters of recommendation uh, on your behalf. The other thing you can be doing, sophomores, is to really be consistent with your extracurricular activities. Now, these should be activities that you're very passionate about and you show long-term involvement. College admission counselors like to see long-term involvement in uh, your extracurricular activities because you're going to be spending four years in college. And if you can stick with four years in college, that should be reflected in long-term involvement with your activities. Your activities can be anything of interest to you. They can be athletics, student government, involvement with student clubs. But along with long-term involvement, you should be involved with leadership in those organizations. Ideally, you should be involved, for example, as a sophomore, as a treasurer uh, in a certain student club that you're interested in or in student government. As a junior, you should be vice president of the club or their class. And as a senior, ideally, you would want to become senior class president or president of the club. You need to remember that leadership is one of the most sought after student qualifications by college admission counselors. College admission counselors equate leadership with good citizenship. So when you're a leader, you're going to come to their college and you're going to be a good citizen and you're going to contribute to the community there by leading some kind of organization or activity. Also, during the spring of your sophomore year, you should plan your summer activities that would dovetail with the activities that you started during your academic year. For example, if you're interested in environmental science, you would look for some kind of internship or volunteer position at a conservation group or another organization that will show your continued involvement and concern for the environment. This will look very strong on your applications for college and show your true dedication uh, with the major you intend to study at the university that you will attend. During this fall semester, because of the COVID-19 situation, it may be very challenging to do all the tasks that I've outlined for sophomores. However, you should do whatever you can to achieve the different tasks and make sure that these things get done by the end of your sophomore year.